Salem Health needed help to sell nearly 10,000 masks for local health care workers amid this pandemic. Elise Ha shares what happened next. They called for help and you answered. Salem Health says that they are just overwhelmed with the community's response. Are you guys going to run out? Run out indeed. Within hours, a line of volunteers who know how to sew showed up outside Salem Health ready to make 10,000 masks for healthcare workers. A couple of sewing machines, they need to get put to work. I've already got my husband, man, in the scissors. One car after another drove up to take home kits to sew. Some teachers who are off work because of school closures say they're finding ways to give back. We decided to come down here early. I go, oh, let's go check out to see if they're open. And this line is super long, which is awesome. Everyone wants to help. Everyone wants to support these health care heroes on the front lines. I work in health care as well, and I work at a skilled nursing facility, and I know the shortage is needed. And so just help out. Wowed by running out of kits, Salem Health posted a statement saying in part, thank you so very much for your willingness to help health care workers, neighbors, and friends. We could only provide kits based on the approved materials we had on hand. They don't plan on asking for help making any more. If you didn't get a chance to participate, don't worry. They still feel the love. They say thank you 10,000 times. For those of you who did pick up kits to help sew, head to coin.com. We have a full list there for you for when and where you can drop those off next week. Reporting in Salem, Elise Haas, Coin6 News. And since they ran out of mask kits, they have canceled the previously scheduled distribution times today in Salem and Dallas. People who are sewing masks, they ask you to continue social distancing and do not hold mask-making parties with friends or ask someone else to help out. Some